Okay, tripod, you need a tripod because it makes the camera sturdy uh, and also consistency because you're always filming from the same spot. So first of all, you need to take out uh, the legs. So on this one, obviously it's a flick. On this one that this camera's on, it's a twist. So flick them all out. Make sure they're all the same length. Um, so that your camera will be filming straight. Okay, so that's nice and sturdy now. Okay, so you can't move that up and down at the minute. So what you need to do is sort out the resistance at the side. So the way it goes up and down is you twist the handle. So I can't move that up and down now. If I loosen it, it can now go up and down, okay? What you need to do then, the base that the camera goes on to is by here. So can you all see that lever here? Just undo that and that pops out. There's a screw there which will screw onto the bottom of the camera. Okay? So just screw it in and then slide it back in. Look how easy it goes in. And then just twist it in and then that camera's locked there. What you can also do, this one's got a handle here to raise it up. That one doesn't have a handle on it, this one does. And then just by twisting it, it increases the height of the camera, okay? Um, you then need to know to take it down, it's exactly the same, just opposite. So technical. It's not bad. And then you would just flatten these down. If you leave them all at once, put them down at the same time. And it just saves you a little bit of time. Okay, with the camera. I'll make sure you've got these cameras booked out, so the lens cover should be on. The way you flip the lens cover off is down the side, just flip that switch down. The way you turn it on is just open it. And then it just turns on, you hear the noise and the camera's on then. Recording's really easy, that red button there, turn it on, and then turn it off. That's all you do with the film. That's, yeah, all you do. Turn it off, you just close it. Um, if your zoom's not quite right, you'll see that button there. If you do that, so turn it to the left zooms out, taking it to the right zooms in, you can just adjust your zoom that way. What lesson are we ever carrying? Biomechanics. We are in biomechanics. Let's mark out a meter for this rugby passing All right. drill we're about to. This is for the purpose of dart fish. Yeah. Give me a cut. Oh. I'll stick mine on this blue one. Oh. Make sure it's in the centre. Yeah. So we go from the centre of the cone. Yeah, pull it tight. There we go. So that is that is a meter there. Yeah. That is a meter. Got that on camera. We got that. Right. Once we secure our meter points, we can take them up. Yep. You want to try and throw it through the hoop using the correct technique. Do you want to demonstrate correct technique? This is B, Somerset rugby player. You need one hand at the top, one at the bottom. Bend your elbow and just push it. Look at that push. Decent. 